Welcome to the Autel Training Academy. I'm John Amato. Today we're going to continue with the introduction of Autel's new line of battery analysis tools with a look at the MaxiBoss BT506. The BT506 is one of two new app-based battery analysis tools developed by Autel. We'll look at the BT508 in an upcoming video. In this video, we're presenting the whole picture, from box to testing, with tool registration, firmware updating, and Bluetooth pairing along the way. So let's get to it. This is the BT506. We have our positive and negative alligator clamps, which are polarity protected. So even if you reverse the clamps and put the negative on the positive terminal, it's okay. In fact, the testers will flash red to alert you that you have made the error. And the tester is Bluetooth enabled, and that's how it shares the test information with the app. The LED on the tester is color-coded to alert the user of connection and testing status. It's a nice, simple tool, but it's not your average battery tester. When designing its new line of battery, starting, and charging system tools, Autel considered what is required of the battery on today's modern vehicles. From infotainment and advanced driver assistance systems to start-stop ignitions, more is required from the battery than ever before. So Autel developed a tester that measures not only state of the charge, but also the battery's state of health, its capacity, its ability to maintain and store the energy, so when needed, the vehicle systems can draw from it. Let's set it up. The BAS app runs on both Apple and Android devices. Here's our quick start guide. Right on the bottom here is a QR code linking to the BAS app. Download the app and log in with your Autel account registered email address and password. Don't have an Autel account? Create one right from the app. Once logged in, the screen displays with instructions to pair the BAS tester with my device. It's simple. I just scan the QR code on the back of the tester, I confirm the information displayed, and tap to bind and complete the registration. Press and hold the power button on the tester. Back on the app, we tap on the Me icon at the bottom of the screen, and then tap BAS Manager to ensure the tester successfully connects to the device and that the firmware is up to date. Now we're going to test a couple of batteries, one outside the vehicle and the other still connected. First, let's test this 12 volt battery. It's for a smaller vehicle. It has a CCA rating of 370. Tap out of vehicle test. The BT506 displays how to correctly connect the clamps to the terminals. And we select the CCA right here. Then we press begin test. Here are our results. The tester gives us an all green odometer like rating with a 94% of SOH or state of health and a 63 SOC or state of charge. And it tells us that the battery is good, but it needs to be recharged. And that's a comforting note because this battery has been in a vehicle vacationing in a garage for the whole winter and just spent maybe an hour on a trickle charger. Our test will be automatically saved on the app's history folder and all ready to view, print, or share anytime we wish. Next, we're going to perform an in-vehicle test on the Toyota RAV4. Tap in-vehicle test. We can then populate the vehicle's information fields and complete the required data on the application and the battery. And in a similar method to the out of vehicle test, we read the CCA off the battery and input it into the screen. We connect the clamps. We'll follow the step-by-step -step instructions to first test the battery, then test the starter, and finally, test the alternator. With the condition of each component displaying on the screen, once completed, we can scan the report and print or share it. For more information on this or any of Autel's products, visit autel.com. Thanks for watching.